สวัสดีค่ะ Welcome to Flower in the Kitchen Channel. Today I will show you how to make sticky rice by using a metal strainer. It is very easy and quick. Today I will cook 500 grams of sticky rice. Wash allow one or two times. Then drain the water out. Boiling hot water and pour into the pot. Stir to separate the rice grain. Then cover the lid and let it soak for at least 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, drain the water out. And wash two or three times or until the water is clear. Then wash out the starchy liquid from the grain. Wash until the water is clear. To do this is help the sticky rice get soft but not soggy and stay longer. To make the sticky rice not stick to your hand and your fork while you eat it, I will add 1 teaspoon of cooking oil. Mix it well together. And drain into a metal stainer. Let it sit until all water drain out. Add water into the pot. My pot is only 15 cm high. The higher pot is the base. So I add water allow 5 cm. Because we need space for the steam to come out. And then I will place my stainer on top like this. And then cover the lid. Before start to steam, I make a big hole at the middle of the stainer like this. To help the steam go all around. If the hole of the stainer is wider than this, it will be perfect. But that is okay, I just use what I have in my kitchen. As you see that, my pot and stainers are not really fit. But that is not a problem. I will show you how to make it work. I have my hot boiling water here. Then, place the stainer down into the pot. And do not forget to make a hole at the middle, then cover the lid. As you can see that there is big gap in between the pot and the stainer. This will take longer time for cooking. So I will use some kitchen towel to cover as a second layer. Steam on high heat. After 20 minutes, Open to check. I can see that my sticky rice is nearly done. Then I will flip it over. And also keep checking your pot. 
add some more hot water if all the water start dry out now i will flip it over like this and spray some water around on top of the rice. I use allow 1 fourth cup. Then cover the lid again. Continue steaming for another 15 minutes. And now it is done. Take it out to cool down and spread it out to release the steam and the heat by doing this your sticky rice will not get too wet when keep it in the containers I will keep it in the bamboo dim sum steamer. Press the wet cheese cloth. And add in the sticky rice like this. If you want to keep it for later, put it in the box and cover it good. Do you know? Bamboo dim sum steamers also can steam the sticky rice. But from the stainer, it is easier for me. If you want to use the bamboo steamer, press the wok at water and find some rags or chopstick. Then press down your steamers on top of it. Do not forget to press your wet cheese cloth before add the soaked sticky rice and do the same as you do for the stainer. And now my sticky rice is all in. Cover the top and ready to serve. Before you go, please subscribe and turn on the notification bell for my new video. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoy it and hope to see you on my next video. Bye!